Politburo sat today in its the 305th ordinary session and it received several updates, amongst which were reports on Zim asset, agriculture, preparations for the 16th National People's Conference, disciplinary committees, and the commissariat report. On Zim asset, the Secretary for Legal Affairs as Minister of Finance and Economic Development gave an update report on the, to the Politburo on Zim asset. The major highlights of the report were the completion of Tokwe Mukosi Dam in Masungo province uh, on the 12th of December 2016. This means the dam can now capture rainfall from the current season and they will be able to irrigate 26,000 hectares when land is prepared downstream. I said that the board notes had been well received by the general public contrary to what opposition papers and opposition parties were publishing and anticipating. Update on agriculture. The Minister of Agriculture, Mechanization and Irrigation Development, Dr. Joseph Madden, reported that there has been a significant increase in the hectare already under crop as compared to the same period last year. This hectare is bound to increase as the rains improve. The hectare under soil has more than doubled as compared to the same period last year. <coughs> Dr. Made reported to Politburo that government was in the process of importing seed <coughs> for grasses to assist livestock farmers. Communal and A1 farmers were now benefiting from the provincial, from the presidential input scheme across the country. Each household will receive 10 kgs of seed, one bag each of basal fertilizers and top dressing fertilizer. Update on preparations for the 16th National People's Conference. The Secretary for Administration, Komed Chombo, informed the Politburo that preparations for the 16th National People's Conference are now complete. All supporting infrastructure, including upgraded power and communication systems, as well as water supply, are in order and functional. Accommodation and transport arrangements for the delegates are also in place. Sufficient food has been sourced, so come 14th of December 2016, we are ready to receive the delegates for the 16th National People's Conference. Disciplinary Appeals and the Reviews Committee of the Central Committee. Committee member Honorable Jeff Mdenda reported to the Politburo on behalf of Vice President and Second Secretary Comrade Mpoko on the cases they deliberated on in the committee's meetings. In his report, Two members had their suspensions uplifted, seven had their suspensions upheld, and one was expelled, and the six had their cases referred to the National Disciplinary Committee for further investigations. This report completes the deliberations of cases that were brought before the <coughs> Appeals Committee. This means we, the, there is no longer any case before the Appeals Committee or a attended to. Commissariat report. The Secretary for Commissariat, Comrade S. Kasukuere, highlighted the party's victory in Chimani Mani West by election. This has given the party confidence as we prepare for the Bikita West by election scheduled for the 21st of January next year. He reported that the party remains solid and the mobilization meetings are held regularly. He further reported that the Chitepo School of Ideology continues to train party cadres, especially executive members of the women and the youth leagues. This is the end of uh, my brief report.